You know, speaking of heavyweights, uh, Anthony Joshua is fighting uh, this weekend against Molina. A lot of people are expecting him to just completely blow over the guy. But what do you make uh, of the potential matches? Because they're saying after this fight, he goes and he fights Klitschko. And that's the one that's really making people think, can he beat a Klitschko, a guy that has so much more experience than him? I think Joshua is the best heavyweight in the world today. I think he, I really do. I think he had a great amateur background. He's getting better as a pro. I like Joshua a lot. I think he can beat all those guys. But um, you know, the one that would give him trouble though is Fury, the little crazy one. <laughs> Yeah. Very crazy. Oh, yeah, very, very crazy. crazy. <laughs> he's saying, but he's funny though. I like. If you're watching this, I like. Do keep doing you. <laughs> he's entertaining. Yeah. He is entertaining. But the thing is, he can give anyone trouble because he, he's so awkward. You know, it's yeah. just like he's not like a real fighter. Like he doesn't do anything like fighters do. But that would be the only difficult fight for him. I, I think just because of style. But I do think Joshua is maybe the best heavyweight out there, and hopefully we'll see that soon if they all start fighting each other because the heavyweight division is making a little bit of noise finally. You know, it's been a while. Now they, 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 they all need to get together and fight each other and the best guy will win. You got Parker and Ruiz. Ruiz is a good little heavyweight, even though he's a little smaller. Yeah. He's, he's fast. I used to train him. He's a very good fighter. Great, great hand speed, great combinations. He's in tough, though. I mean, going all the way to New Zealand yeah. also. That's a long Line, trip. Lines but down. the thing is, um, you know, I hear Parker's pretty good, too. But, I mean, we haven't got a chance to see him on TV yet or anything like that because he's so far away. But he needs to come to America to, make, uh, to really make himself well-known. So you feel that Joshua gets past Klitschko and Wilder because they're also pushing for that Wilder fight yep. after the Klitschko. Really? Because a lot of people feel that Wilder could probably pull it off. No. No. But he's like, no, no. Nah. <laughs> well, Why not? Why do you think like that? Better amateur background, better fighter, um, more condition, doesn't fool around in fights and just like, you know, start dancing in the middle of the round and so forth. He's serious about what he does. Wilder's just like playing the games. I don't think he's that good.